Hi friends, I hope you all are doing well. I completed my first long run outdoors today after a long time, which is after the end of COVID-19 circuit breaker or lockdown. 12 kilometer run on the day one of 100 days of running challenge. Good luck to all of those who register for 100 days of running challenge. In this video, I'm going to take you to a virtual tour of my two days running route in Singapore and also talk about five extremely important running tips for beginner runners based on my experience as a full marathoner. Tip number one, be prepared to start running as a fitness journey. You must understand the benefits of running. Some of the most important benefits of running are, running can improve your cardiovascular fitness. Running can strengthen your bones and muscles. You can maintain your healthy body weight by burning more calories and improves metabolisms. Tip number two. Start slowly with interval, run or walk. Break down the distance or time into small intervals of uh, walk and run. Don't be worried about walking more initially during these intervals. Look for workout time, not for distance. After a few days, you can increase your running interval duration slowly up to the point where you can run the entire distance at a stretch without having to walk. Tip number three, listen to your body always. You must listen to your body while running and how your um, body felt after running. Do not hesitate to stop when you experience discomfort while running. Do not compare yourself with other runners. You must give enough time for your body to recover after your run. Tip number four, add warm up and cool down for each workout. Running without warm up may cause injuries that may take more time for recovery. 
it is good to add at least 10 minutes of warm up stretches before starting your run and 10 minutes of full body stretching to cool down after your run. Tip number 5 Add strength training at least once in a week Adding core strengthening exercises at least once per week will reduce your risk of uh, running injuries and improve your running pace. Take a note that too much strength training will likely impact your quality of running with increasing risk of injuries. Thank you for watching this video, stay tuned for more updates and tips on fitness. Please post your comments if you have any questions, share and subscribe my channel if you like it so that you can get notified when I post new videos. Thank you.